by seven o'clock in the morning we were already up we had our breakfast in the hotel that was a delicious breakfast that we had we went back to our room and there was a, a little bit of discussion between myself and my wife as to what we were going to do since we didn't have anything planned for the day uh, she suggested that we go to the beach and I told her okay we could spend time um, in the swimming pool and walk around to visit places record videos but if my wife makes up her mind on something uh, you can change her mind so I couldn't convince her to stay with me in the swimming pool so we finally concluded that we were going to the beach so we had to get ready and within the next 10 minutes we were all upset to go to the beach although we didn't prepare enough for the beach but then at the end of the day it was a beautiful uh, experience and I'm more grateful uh, to my wife for making that decision La mujer más bella en el mundo está aquí en Miami, Quality Inn. Quality Inn. ¿Con quién, ¿Con quién fuiste al holiday? <laughs> es que estamos aquí en el lugar muy turístico y el centro de Miami. Adivina, aquí hay bastante gente que habla español, hay gente que sabe mucho, gente bonita, gente maravillosa del mundo. <laughs> Ok, entonces me encuentro con mi esposa que ha vivido aquí hace tres meses, pero hoy estamos juntos. A ver. Where are we going today? What is the plan? Baby, we are going to the Miami Beach. Beach, Miami Beach. All right, it is our first time ever in Miami together and this is and the first, the first time. time that we are going to the beach together yeah in four years in four years the first time we are going to be together in we the are beach. going to the beach together so we just called an uber so let's wait he should be on his way now yeah in three minutes in three minutes he should be here in three minutes all right so in general what is your experience being here in Miami what is the difference what do you make of Orlando and Miami Miami is more expensive to live here for vacation you have to pay more for the rent you have to pay more for the hotel you have to pay more for the, the, the normal things and I, I asked how much they pay workers in the hotel and in other places they pay more than the hour in Orlando but by you have to spend more money here in Miami. Okay, all right. You think that it's expensive. I think it makes sense because here there are a lot of tourists who arrive here. And uh, first, when they come to Florida, they talk of Miami. So Miami is a big city when it comes to the state of Florida. It is something, it's huge because of the famous beaches they have, um, because it's full of Latin Americans and full of people from all walks of life. So, Muchos lugares venezolanos. Yeah. Mm -hmm. A lot of places. You can find Venezuelan. Venezuelan people, yeah. So I on on their airplane I, I asked one guy that what does he make of Miami because he's from here in Miami and then he answered that Miami is a place to visit not a place to live okay I think that Uber arrived there are millions of people visiting Miami United States in Florida every year numerous people all over the world from the north south east and west merges and comes to Miami to visit families reunion people who wants to take vacation honeymoon all come to Miami and they spend quality and amazing time here in Miami uh, me being here with my wife has uh, in fact added more love to the love that we share has added more bond has brought us more joy than we ever imagined Miami is an amazing place it's very beautiful with diversity in, in, in culture because of the differences in languages, differences in skin color, differences among the people that you can all find here in this beautiful, amazing city. 
I'm going to recommend each and every one of you if you have the opportunity to visit any one country in the world I would say that come to the United States and if you have to visit anywhere in the United States I'm going to recommend you to come to Miami Miami okay. Esto es un hotel. ¿Y la cárcel? Un hotel. Aquella, ¿no? Aquella. ¿Ves? Mira, esto, mira. Esto es otro hotel. Mira. restaurants we had our lunch at the beach it was really delicious then we walked around um, around the beach we had fun we laughed we ran we we, we played a couple games in the beach and we watched other people swim and it was fun I must admit that I was impressed about how the place was kept clean I was much impressed about the attitude of the lifeguards who were working there. They were so open and friendly. The servers were amazing and great. And I enjoyed staying at the beach and I enjoyed my time with my wife. And I love it when you take it all off of me. You're laughing a sense that you're insecure. Can't tell what you did before. Make bueno, feel like you're less you more. Aquí estamos. Bra, bra, bra. Miami Beach. So what do you think about the beach? What do you think about the beach? I think it will be amazing. Excellent. I hope you guys who are planning on visiting Miami would um, get themselves ready because there are a lot of things to do here in Miami there are diverse activities to do here in Miami that may not cost that much for example going to the beach you don't need to pay any fee to get inside the beach and you don't need to spend that much on food because there are food from any part of the world you could find food easily so about the Miami Beach um, what actually goes on here like I mean right here pretty much uh, what we're doing here is these are all the hotels okay this is all the aerial hotels so pretty much if you guys are staying in the hotels 
you can come out to the beach they give you the free chairs you know you can rent the umbrellas and stuff this area here is pretty safe for the most part you know there's not a lot of crime in this area um you know if the, when the people come over here we make sure that we look over their stuff okay. you know we ha we do have security from the hotel if we have a problem we call them you know they come out and they solve the issue we call the police if anything happens but for the most part it's pretty safe here okay. you know you can leave your stuff there no one will take it it's okay. not a problem and then you have like lifeguards because she doesn't yeah. know how to yeah. swim man. Okay. <laughs> yes the lifeguard you see those houses over there yeah okay. those, houses, yeah. those are the lifeguard posts oh, okay. there's one every what Every other like few like yards, yeah. Yeah. every um, other like 60 yards, there's one. What, what is the schedule of the beach? It's open all the days. Uh, until 10 p.m. Okay. okay. Yeah, so once, once the hotel closes, if you want to stay, you can stay until 10 p.m. Okay, and uh, if somebody wants to have yeah. drinks, like, unfortunately, how much is the price? It depends. If you're getting drinks from the hotel, uh, it, a, a drink can range anywhere from 15 to $20. Okay. okay. Like with taxes and everything. Yeah, and here, you know, we can find something like a Dollar Tree, Walmart, or something like this. If there's, the people want to stay maybe one month here. Yeah, yeah, there's, you, if you go to, to, uh, to the street, there's always stores, there's CVS, Walgreens. Uh, I mean, Walmart might be a little further away from here, but there is like convenience stores and stuff like that. Why do I always say subscribe to my YouTube channel? Because the more you subscribe, the more you click on the like button, and YouTube is going to send my videos to other people to also watch the video. And the more people watch, the more I get encouraged, the more I get motivated to make new videos. Yeah. En español, tienes que suscribirte, parceros. Así es, así es, hermano. Yeah, yeah.